Yama, my name's Carly. And I'm Pete. And we are here today at the Warren Bungles National Park. We are two Gamilaroi custodians with a huge passion for the sky and for storytelling. And we are coming to you from a place that has been used for stargazing for tens of thousands of years. And even today, many astronomers are still coming here in order to use the Sighting Spring Observatory on top of the ranges to do that same thing, to view the sky. Yeah, and if we have a look behind us, we can actually see the mountaintops that make up the Warren Bungle National Park. And that was from millions of years ago. There was a lot of volcanic activity in the area. And over thousands of years, that volcanic activity gave rise to the Warren Bungle Mountains. And one interesting feature in particular is the old man just behind us. And we can see that he's constantly looking up at the sky and stargazing as he has done now for thousands of years. Yeah, it makes me think of a story of the, the Mie Mie, the Pallades or the Seven Sisters. One Gamilaroi story talks about the clever man who's chasing the sisters. And as he's chasing them down, he's actually creating these huge features in the landscape, including some of the pillars that we see around us. Now, before we get too far ahead of ourselves, um, we do need to remember that we are here at Siding Spring Observatory on Gamilaroi country. And as custodians, it's important that we welcome visitors to the lands to provide them with safe passage. And so I would just quickly like to do that firstly in language and then in English after that. So we are standing here on the lands of the Gamilaroi peoples um, and I would like to welcome you to these lands. Now a welcome to country is um, a two-way street though. And as visitors are on those lands of the traditional custodians, it's important that they then acknowledge that country, acknowledge those elders and acknowledge the people of those lands, as well as the land itself for providing for them as they make their visits. So here we are at Mount Stromlo Observatory here on the ANU campus in Canberra. And I would like to now acknowledge the traditional custodians of the lands on which we are, firstly in Gamilaroi, which is our language, and then in English after that. We're standing here on the lands of the Nunawala Nambri peoples. I acknowledge their elders, I acknowledge their ancestors, and I acknowledge the people of this land. Now, during this course, we hope to give you some insight into Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander peoples and their culture. We're also going to touch on their collective histories. We're going to look at how Indigenous peoples of this continent were able to use sky observations for practical purposes down here on the land. We're also going to be looking at the night sky and the different ways you're able to look at it, whether you're a backyard astronomer or whether you're a professional astronomer. We're also going to touch on the importance of dark skies and the challenges uh, people like us today have in trying to preserve those dark skies. Now during this course, and as we talk about these topics, we by no means intend to come across as experts in these fields. These are very diverse and different types of fields we're talking about. So with that, we really aim to give you our perspective as two Gamilaroi astronomers. Mm -hmm.